what, what do you think your options are? Uh, what might you do? What are the pros and cons of, of that choice? What I would say to my younger self in those first few weeks of, of leading a team is probably three things. I'd say re relax, listen very carefully, and trust your instincts. One thing that I've observed is, is I, I think we underestimate how close attention people pay to us. Um, one of the things that I've learned is you cannot not communicate. So that everything you do and, and even the things that you don't do communicate to people. So if you don't, if you don't explain yourself, people will read into to what you do or, or what you don't do. One thing that surprised me, I suppose, from my early experiences as a manager is, is how often people will solve a problem for themselves if you listen and help them work through the situation. You don't have to always solve the problems for them. You're not in it on your own. You're in it together with a, with a team. So you don't have to make all the decisions yourself. Uh, you can bring people together, you can help them, they can, they can help you solve the problem. Uh, and, and ultimately, you, know, you don't have to be the smartest person in the room, you don't have to be the, the, the most talented person in the room, but you can bring those talented people together and together you can make a, a great decision and, and, and make great progress as a team.